bunny. Are you hungry? We have three Californian does. We were going to breed, but we've not been able to get a buck. So, where'd you go? Back there to hide? Um, we were given this hutch, so I redid, we redid the wire on the bottom, and then we added the back part so that each one has an area they can go in. Hi, are you hungry? Each one has an area that they can go in. And hide or make their, have their babies and get away from the wind or whatever the weather is. So, so far it's, it's um, worked out pretty good. All the poop falls down underneath and I'm just gonna shovel that out and use it for the garden. So we need to get some hay. It looks like they, hey, it looks like they're a little low. So we're gonna get some hay while we're at the farm. And right now we're using the water, um, two liter water for them. And that seems to work pretty good. We haven't gotten too cold. We've had a couple cold, cold nights, but we haven't had it too cold where they freeze. Since we are in town, we are going to get the ones that you can plug in. Uh, I've never, this will be our first winter with rabbits. But this is the biggest girl we have. She is pretty big and she is the friendliest. This one, not so much. And this one is I don't know. Sometimes she's okay, and then sometimes she's like, "Get away from me!" We had um, we had a New Zealand white um, doe, and she had a litter of babies, and all seven of them did. They, I thought they were our first litter, so I thought they looked like they were doing good, and then by day eight. They were all dead. So, I don't know. They had their eyes open. They were in the nesting box. And then there were three outside of the nesting box. I don't I don't know. I don't know what happened there. But um, we, we got rid of her. But I'm going to feed them and head to the farm. Hey. We just feed them a pelleted feed and some black sunflower seeds right now. Sometimes we put other things in it, but right now that's what we have. They were out of pellets at the store the other day, so I had to improvise and give them a little bit more sunflower seeds than usual just because it's hard doing this one-handed. Kind of windy here today, but I wanted to share our new rabbit, Anna. We have, I had a friend call us and, and say, were we interested in a rabbit? And this is a chocolate harlequin, magpie harlequin, and I put the hay in here just because it is cold and I wanted them to have something that they can like keep warm with. They usually don't have this much hay but since it's been really cold I have the hay. She used to be, she used to be in um, a classroom so I was told she was very friendly. But she is very pretty.
What do you think, Bill? We do um, their names, A, B, C, D, through the alphabet. We went ahead and gave Anna the A because the buck is also, we were also given a hard looking buck. And the buck is also an A because he's our first buck. So we went ahead and gave her the A name so that if when we breed, the babies will be AA and then whatever number, how many ever number babies. But that's how we're going to do it. This is Anna. This is Bill. Well, we haven't decided the C name. And then Daisy. Daisy, I don't know how well she's going to do. She, uh, Belle is our friendliest. Our friendliest of the Californians. Daisy down there, not so much. Let me go get you some water. Let me go get you some water. I'll be back. All right. Let's go meet Abu. Liam named the male Harlequin Abu. So, let's go visit him. Hold on. This is Abu. I scared him. Didn't mean to. He's in the horse trailer right at the moment. Easy. He is a black magpie Harlequin. He has a little bit split right here, but not much. But we picked him up yesterday, so right now he's in he's in the cage in the horse trailer. We um we weren't prepared for we were prepared for one more, we weren't prepared for two more. So he's kind of small. He's smaller than the Anna, but Hopefully, we'll get him his own buck cage and get him set up. But, just wanted to introduce you to our new additions to the rabbits. We're going to do more videos of the rabbits come spring because I'm going to be building. I want to use the um, tractors for the babies like Living Traditions does. So we're going to be trying those out. So we'll bring you along this spring. We're, we're going to be getting everybody bred and starting all that really soon. So just wanted to show you our new, wanted to show you our new additions to Grace Homestead Farm.